you look at a menu, what attracts you? Usually, it will be the appearance of the food that weights our appetites. However, did you know that the color of the plate or packaging that holds our oh-so-yummy treats and meals can have a huge effect on how appealing our food may look and even our perception of flavor? D. Scientists have found that certain packaging or plate colors can increase the appeal of a type of food. For example, a study conducted by Aris and Elisa in 2010 found that the color of dessert packagings may lead to expectations regarding the taste of its contents. In particular, Yellow packagings were associated with delicious, sweet vanilla desserts, while black packaging was associated with bitter chocolate desserts. Furthermore, packaging and plate color can influence how much food one eats. This was demonstrated in a study conducted by Akiol et al. in 2018, in which participants had a higher food intake when they consumed from a red or black plate, as compared to a white plate. As food lovers, we thus decided to try this experiment out ourselves. And our research question was, how does background color affect the attractiveness of food? With our classmates as our experimental guinea pigs, we prepared five different colors of paper bowls, white, black, red, yellow, and blue. These bowls were then filled with the same brand and flavor of chips, specifically Meadows brand original chips, and offered to our classmates. They were then asked which chips looked the most and least appetizing to them. So which colour do you think looks the most appetising and which looks the least? Uh, I think the yellow looks the most appetising and the black one seemed the least appetising to me. That was yellow and then the least appetising was black. Yeah, for me the best was white and then the least appetising was black. From our survey, we observed that out of the 8 classmates who participated in the study, Five of them felt that the yellow bowl of chips looked the most appetizing, while the chips in the black bowl looked the least appetizing. These results are supported by a study conducted by Van Etersum and Wan Sink, which found that people tended to consume more when the color contrast between the food and its background was lower. Furthermore, there is a possibility that the uncertainty regarding black plates could stem from humans' foraging experiences in evolutionary past, whereby black was associated with potentially poisonous food. Conversely, yellow is associated with feelings of hunger and is able to act as an appetite enhancer as it triggers the release of serotonin, putting one in a good mood. However, it is possible that the aspect of color contrast affects appetite more than the specific colors used. For example, red is said to be an appetite enhancer as it is able to increase one's heart rate and the blood flow to the digestive system, making one hungry. Notwithstanding, the chips in the red bowl were not found to be more appetizing than other colors. As such, we can assume that the specific bowl colors does not have as much influence on how appetizing the chips looked compared to the contrast between the chips and its plating. In conclusion, our results support that lower color contrast between food and its background makes food look more appealing to consumers. The application of this concept can be seen within the food and beverage industry both in the advertisements of food and menu designs in physical stores. For example, advertisements by McDonald's regularly use red backgrounds that not only increase appetite levels, but also have a low contrast with the brown meat patties and sauces. Furthermore, parents and caretakers of peaky eaters may find this result useful as potential applications of this may include plating usually avoided foods on plates with less color contrast to increase their visual appeal. 
Indeed, these findings have many useful implications. However, more experiments with different types of food, such as sweet foods or differently colored foods, should be done in order to confirm our findings.